Talking to Eric Lopez here from Bassmasters. All right, Eric, what is unique about this area, and why would Bassmasters want to come to Waddington to do a fishing event? Sure, absolutely. Well, first off, thank you for having me. Glad to be here. Um, what's unique about this area is is the terrain, the beauty. Uh, this is my first time in the area. A uh, gentleman who I work with did site selection, came out here about a year ago, and said, you're going to love this place. The anglers, the fishermen, they're going to love this place. So I landed yesterday, and sure enough, it, it's awesome. Uh, where we're going to stage the event in downtown Waddington is awesome. Mm. The water is great. I've been talking to a lot of the anglers. They're excited about coming here. They love coming up north. They love coming to the north country. So there's a lot of different factors that, that are, are the reason, all of those that I just mentioned, why we're here. Um, For the fishermen, how is fishing here different than other parts of the country? You know, uh, we fish in different parts of the country at different part, times of the year. So we're just finishing a uh, south, southeastern swing uh, where it's hot, uh, and you could, you catch different things, small mouth, large mouth. So, uh, there's a Toyota point series that culminates, uh, all of these events. So, um, it's, it's pretty much a, a hot race right now. So everyone's excited to see what's going to happen by coming up to this body of water and see how that's going to shake the points up a little bit. Now, for those who are going to be attending in August, what should we expect to see and in, in Waddington? Sure. Absolutely. Well, the events are August 8th through the 11th. Everything is free. Uh, right at uh, the park downtown, uh, and what we're doing are the weigh-ins. That's kind of the culmination of the event. At 315, we'll have the weigh-ins. But that's just one small component. Starting at 11 o'clock each day, starting on Thursday, uh, there's going to be basically the largest festival that this area has seen in a long time. Um, there's going to be free food, music, sponsors, demos. You could ride uh, a boat. Uh, we'll have boat demos going on. Uh, there'll be uh, a beer garden. Uh, there'll be a separate music stage uh, with a lot of activities. Uh, there'll be fireworks one evening. Uh, so we really encourage people to go to uh, our website, Bassmaster.com, uh, forward slash elites, to see the full schedule. Uh, I know the information is, is here locally as well. Mm -hmm. um, but there's a lot of people that have been planning a lot of different things uh, at this event. So it's really a, a family festival. Now, should you come back to Waddington, how often would you come back? Every year, every other year? How does that usually work? You know, that's one thing that we need to figure out. Uh, when the event's done, we, we take a step back and we see how everything went from the fishing, from the crowds, from the event itself, and then we analyze and then we talk to the local hosts and, and see, hey, one, do you want us to come back? Right. Uh, are we invited back? And then two, what will it take? So, uh, yeah, if we have a good event, we definitely come back. And as far as the fishermen go, these are the best of the best, right? Yeah, the, this isn't your, your weekend warrior. These are the guys that you see on ESPN and ESPN2 on Saturday and Sunday morning. These are professional anglers. Uh, they fish for a living. They, they don't have other jobs. They're fully sponsored. Uh, coming to this event is kind of like going to a NASCAR event. Their boats and trucks are all rigged out with their sponsors. The jerseys, all that. We'll have the ESPN cameras on. So, yes, this is a, a professional tournament-level fishing. So these guys have their own entourages as well, don't they? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, we'll have a pit crew kind of like at a NASCAR event as well. Okay. I mean, some of these guys have backup boats, so if they break down, their sponsors are, are providing them with backup boats, wow. so they don't miss a minute of fishing. This is not like any other tournament that you've seen. So the pit crew is just for the boat itself, or do they work with the equipment, the fishing lines, and all that too? Uh, Both, actually. Really? It depends on the level of the angler. Yeah, wow. it's not uncommon for some <laughs> of our top-level anglers to break down and then their sponsor will get them a boat, if not immediately, within the next few hours. Okay, the biggest event to hit the area pretty much ever. August 8th to 11th, Waddington. This is going to be a, a great time. Thanks for coming in today. Thanks for having me. Appreciate it.